Hey guys, and welcome to another World of Warcraft video. And for today's video, I'm going to show you how you can go get the Shadowpan Gazer Gun. This is kind of like a hidden achievement, but it's not actually an achievement, so don't expect an achievement to pop up when you finish it. But it's all for this toy. The toy is pretty cool. I'll show you at the end of the video what the toy looks like and all that. So basically what you do, right before the turtle boss in Throne of Thunder, you will enter right here. So this is, this is the part right after the bridge and you'll drop down. And so this is what you want to do before you attack the turtle boss. The turtle boss does not need to be killed for this. Uh, it's just once you drop down, you may have difficulties getting back to this ledge. Also, I had actually started this on a different difficulty. So depending on what difficulty you choose, you may see another one that has um, a, a big pool in the middle. Uh, the reason I never ended up doing it on that difficulty is not that it's easier on another, it's exactly the same on all difficulties as far as like how tough it is to do this. But the reason was because I had gone so frustrated, I gave up and I went and killed the rest of the raid. So in order for me to do this on the same day, uh, I had to choose a different difficulty and to be honest it's faster if you choose the LFR because you can just queue right in and it will bring you right to this. So the difference is you wouldn't have the middle part. Uh, for the middle part I had been kind of, you can see, you can see two at each end, I was using the two at the end to go to the middle, right, middle, left, middle, right. And that was my tactic for a while there. And then when I got here and realized there was no middle, I kind of had no choice but to go around in a circle. And I discovered that going around in the circle is actually easier than the middle was. So once you get the tactic down, it, it was actually not bad. I, I really felt like I was going to pull it off. There was, there was one time I was really close and my mouse like glitched out and it, it totally fucked up the angle and I ended up in the water. But other than that, you know, I think more of the RNG was in my mouse than it was in the actual gameplay. <laughs> So, um, so this is the tactic. Uh, basically how I did it is I made sure I was always facing the next one. As you can see, I'm turning the camera every round and yeah. And a lot of it is just staying focused and doing this 250 times because it can it can be a little much focusing that and especially since uh you can see on the clock there that it was pretty late when i did this uh yeah so the focus wasn't it was there but not as much there as it could be right so yeah, like I said, once you get the tactic down, it's pretty, pretty easy. And when you get the 250 jumps, you will, um, you will get the item in the mail. So if you don't see something pop up, that's completely normal. Like nothing cool happens on the 250th, but you will know when you get it because well, I, I was going to say it'll stop, but if you notice that it's not going up, then you notice you're at 250. But basically, that's how it works. Like, it'll just, it won't go past 250. 
Uh, you can kind of see that at the end of this, I just kept going to kind of test if it would keep going and it didn't, so I just stopped. Okay, so let's hearth out of here and let's see what the toy looks like. Okay, so we are back to our mailbox and this is the note they left us, which was kind of cool. I liked the note and the toy will be attached and uh, basically just you can spray you know friendlies or mobs with water and it's got a 30 minute cooldown and lasts roughly five minutes you know it's always nice to have something from a challenge that you know not only has you know a challenge to it but also you know this is a hidden challenge i I've been running TOT for years and I had no idea that this even existed. Meanwhile, I have all the achievements out in TOT. Like, I literally would probably never have realized this toy existed if I wasn't actually putzing around for the most part because I, I have pretty much everything. I have the the sets out there and all that but you know due to me being a completionist there was a couple of items that don't belong in an achievement and they aren't part of like a legit set but they're items I didn't collect and yeah and I just wanted it to say collected on my account for okay guys so that concludes this video I hope you enjoyed. Have fun doing this little challenge to get your toy. It's, uh, it's a pretty cool looking toy. I like it a lot. And, you know, and on top of that, it'll just add another toy to your collection. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.